Hello everyone and welcome back to Nier Automata. My name is Tom, otherwise known as Titanium Legman. And today, we have some more side quests to do. Now, first points of order, some points of business. A couple of things. First off, we have successfully upgraded our first weapon to level 3, which I didn't realize was like a milestone of sorts, but apparently it is. So, after the last episode, I was just looking around the resistance camp, seeing what upgrades I could get, since we got a bunch of materials, uh, selling off some fish, things like that. And I realized that we could upgrade our virtuous contract to level 3, which we did. Uh, it's now by far our strongest light weapon, although I'm sure that will change as we upgrade some of the other stuff that we've gotten. Uh, it has the attack speed up, and it has another level of combo, which is fun. And yeah, just generally it's pretty cool. Also, we got the next story piece for it. How long can I continue to believe in a world laden with deceit and folly? How long, I wonder? Good questions to ask. Now, apparently, level 3 is the maximum level of upgrades we can get on a weapon here at the Resistance Camp. But, the weapons trader said that there is someone else out in the world who can upgrade it to level 4, and that he would like to learn from them. And my guess based on dialogue that we've gotten in Pascal's village is that it is a machine life form out in the forest, I believe, who can upgrade that for us. So we're going to have to keep an eye out for that. Uh, obviously, lots and lots and lots of other upgrades to get, but, you know, we're working on it. So for now, we've gone back to our old, uh, the old standard of the Virtuous Contract and the Machine Axe, because those are just basically our strongest weapons at this point. Will that change? I'm sure. But for now, it's what we've got. Also, I've gone ahead and done some more modifications and whatnot for our chipset because we had a bunch of money. So I was able to get a bunch of space upgrades and we've got a bunch of cool chips. So let's go over what we have real quick, shall we? We have our normal operating system set stuff. We have melee defense four, move speed up one, anti-chain damage, which would help us from getting comboed out, auto heal two, auto use item one, drop rate up three, Fast cooldown 3, and weapon attack 1. Uh, this is all the best stuff that we have. That's a balance of quality and space optimization. So, pretty happy with it for now. Obviously, we have some more space to unlock, and there will be some other interesting chips that we're going to get. But for now, I think it's sufficient. Now, with that all out of the way, the first quest that we have to deal with is right here. Uh, where is it? Where is... Where is it? Manager's Quest, okay. Woo! So it's in here somewhere. We have to go deal with Manager's Request, which is right here in camp. Also, we have another photograph to show to the android who's lost her memories, so... Actually, no, we do need to go up there, huh? We'll be doing that as well. But first, I want to see what's up with this lady over here. Excuse me, is this that music box you were looking for? That's it! Where did you find it? In the amusement park, next to the corpse of an android. Maybe that was its owner? Oh. Was she... Well, it's awfully rusty, but with a little work, I should be able to get it playing again. Of course. Thank you for bringing the box to me. Now I can finally concentrate on my work again. Oh, and you two are welcome to enter the back anytime you like from now on. Ah. Animal bait, tree seed, medium recovery, anti-chain damage plus three. Damn. Ah, oh, the music box. I don't recognize that tune. Is this just its own thing, or is that maybe like a reference to music from somewhere else in the game, or even from the original Nier? I'm not sure. Also, wait, what do we have? Whoa, wait, 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 wait. Wait, what? What do we have back here? Resistance disappearance. Wait. Oh, 
that's right! I forgot about this one! Yo! Okay, cool! I completely forgot that we tried to get into the back before. Sick! Okay, very cool. Good to know that side quests can unlock areas in which we need to do other side quests. That's super important to know. Beautiful. Oh, yeah, look at all these people back here now, dude. Impact Bracer, 200G. Large Luck Plus. All clear to the right, all clear to the left. Nothing to report today. All right. Ugh, what to do, what to do. What's wrong? What's wrong? Thanks, 9S. Maybe I can help you out. Say, you're from the bunker, right? Well, it turns out I have some packages that need transporting, but I can't get them out of storage. One of my superiors was in charge of it, but now I have to do it. And there's so much stuff, I can't possibly move it. She's gonna have my head for this. I gotta get those packages for transport out of there. Think you can get the goods for me? That yeah, should be easy enough. Great, thanks a million. Oh, we're just like going in. Marking objects likely to be uh, the targeted packages. I can't get them out like this. Ugh, better make a path first. It's just a puzzle mini game, huh? Okay. Uh Huh. It's literally just just a box pushing mini game. I Okay. There's got to be something more to this, right? Like, there's no way this is all it is. There's some, there's some sort of tomfoolery that's gonna happen here. Come on. Okay, that should be all of the packages. I... Hmm... Something's weird about this. You went and found everything? Well, talk about a lifesaver. You really need to organize your storage area. I could barely walk in there. Seriously, you need to clean that place up. I know, I know. I'll take it up with my superior. Here's a little something for your trouble. Rusted Clump, Skill South, Medium Recovery, Evade Range Up, plus 3 chip, 3000G and 350XP. Okay, that was literally all it was. That's... That's weird. Oh. Look here. There's something carved into this column. Three numbers. I wonder if it's a set of coordinates? Target point, maybe. Or a hidden location. No way to tell. I'll add them to the map regardless. Ah, resistance disappearance. Okay, cool. I guess that's all that's back here, huh? Interesting. I love the music box, though. Ah, oh, I'm a sucker for music box music, like, big time. I don't know why, but just the nature of it always makes me very, like, emotional and happy. Wait, is it just the Resistance Camp theme, but music boxy? Maybe it is. Huh. Interesting. Alright, so we talked to these guys. You, we have another photograph for you, ma'am. This is from the amusement park. I remember having fun there. Together. Together. All right, yeah, clearly she's missing somebody. I'll note how every, or damn near every quest in the Resistance Camp has to do with, like, loved ones or friends or companionship. Like, we've got this theme, this overlying, or underlying, overarching, overlying, sure, whatever, uh, overall theme that runs through everything. Like, it's not, like, 
I'm not some genius for picking up on it. It's painfully obvious, but it's cool. Like, we have this consistent thing going on with all the androids. It's nice. Now, the question is where to go. We have Machine Examination 2 with... Okay. Okay, cool. It's so, like all the parts are like right there. Parade export or escort we are not doing right now. 11B's memento I still need to figure out. Resistance disappearance out by the camp. Okay. That's just all machine examination. Photographs, which we still can't access. And then there's just all sorts of stuff to do over in Pascal's camp. So, um, well, before we go over there, let's go to the desert, get that done. And then we can go get a whole bunch of stuff done simultaneously in Pascal's camp. Or village, or what have you. To the desert! Okay. Jackass. Oh, wait! The carp. Or mackerel. Yes, the mackerel. The holy mackerel. Alright, we're gonna save, and then we're gonna eat this fish, and we're gonna see what happens while we're over here. Uh-oh. Why are we loading?! I wasn't expecting that to trigger a load screen. What the hell? <laughs> what? Having consumed the mackerel, it didn't take long for the android's bodily fluids to congeal. Muscle rigidity and paralysis soon followed. It was good, though. The android thought his consciousness faded. Exquisite, even. No wonder humans used to eat them. Are you serious? That's an ending? <laughs> what was that, the K ending? The mackerel ending, I'm guessing? Why not the M ending? Or the F ending for fish? What? Oh my god. <laughs> oh shit. Alright, alright, get me back in there. Wow, man. Wow. Good job, Yokotaro. You gave us a fish ending. I'm proud of you, bud. <laughs> what goofiness just ensued. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. <laughs> it just killed us. It just straight killed us. Like, we didn't even have a quest for that, right? That was just a thing. Oh, man. I wonder if... Uh... Asshole. Jackass is going to have dialogue for us now. No, there's just nothing. Yeah, I guess because it wasn't actually a quest, huh? Robo Dojo, Trial of Sand. Yeah. Wow. Wow. What a dorky way to do things and get another ending in there. Incredible. I bet. I would bet anything. Unless there's, that's like a recurring joke among Yokotaro games or something. I would bet anything that that was just like a, oh man, I need another ending. I, I want to have 26 endings. One for each letter of the alphabet. What do I do? Make them eat this fish and it kills them. W what, sir? Are you sure? Yes! Deadly fish, do it. And uh, thus the K ending was born. <laughs> oh, I love it. 
But also, I kind of hate it. So this is so dumb. From the resistance camp as coordinates, oh boy, yeah, they're strong. They're pretty much standing right on top of whatever they're pointing to. I'm just gonna get some chip damage in on you, sir. Alright, good to know that gives us some iframes. This guy died horribly. Yeah, come with us, bud. Shockwave 3, ooh. Hijack boost 3? Interesting. Why am I hearing- Oh, jeez, where'd you guys come from? Oh, okay, it doesn't give us perfect iframes. Good to know. Fortunately, our virtuous contract does so much damage now. Nice. Very good. So those guys we can handle without too much issue. Good to know. What the hell? There's gotta be something bad out there. Pray and continue. Did we lose our other android already? Holy crap, we did. Uh-oh. We see a dead resistance member and a bloody android. That's not good. All right, are you just... A yep, you're aggro. Damn, this guy is really strong. Fair enough. Uh, guys, you think he wants to kill us? I think he might want to kill us. Alright, that's maybe not the best attack to use at the moment. Whoa, 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 camera angles, camera angles. Let's unlock on, please. Thank you. Let's just get a little bit of healing. Where are you going, bud? Not too bad to deal with, though. I say as I immediately then get hit. Thank the good lord we've got Virtuous Contract, though, because... And, like, upgraded, because otherwise this would be... This would be tough. We're already not doing that much damage. That doesn't seem to do any damage, but I mean, it keeps him from moving around on us, which is helpful. However, maybe we should give the spears a shot. I don't know. That didn't seem like it did that much, huh? Ah, not quite close enough. Oh, right, missiles. Which actually... Perhaps not the worst strategy. Ah. Not quite at the right angle for the spears. Alright, we're learning that, though. That attack will be good against big groups, but single targets... Or, I suppose, like, big enemies it'll also be good against, but... Yeah, single targets like this, not so much. We're getting him, we're getting him. Should definitely use the other pod, though, for this. Whoa, that did a big chunk of damage. Maybe the gravity does do damage, huh? Or unless I was just 9S chunking him, which is also possible. Uh, please die, though, sir. What's happening here? Huh. There we go. Analyze this machine. Huh? What for? Call it professional curiosity. Analysis. This machine life forms, comrades, were destroyed. 
Driven by that grudge, it lured a resistance uh -huh. man to this location. It then proceeded to destroy him. Are you saying this thing wanted revenge? Oh, come on now. That concept is far too complex for a machine. I wouldn't be so sure, 9S. Hmm. Like, I think we've come across enough evidence to refute that idea. I wonder if it's the resistance member we're looking for. Let's check his memory. Seems this one came here looking for revenge as well. I guess the weaker one lost. <sighs> Man's journal and memory chip. Ooh. Are those items we can access? Bloodied memory chip of a machine life form says its allies were destroyed by the resistance. Journal left behind by a man. Thoughts about his fallen comrades are spelled out within. Interesting. So, yeah, I guess maybe not. Interesting, though. Okay. Cool. Well, I mean, that was, that was tougher than I expected it to be, man. I was not expecting a level 35 fight there. But, uh, we maybe did it, so this. hey. I'm going to cool. feel terrible telling that woman what happened to her friend. It's the truth. She has to know. No matter what that truth actually is. I mean, yeah, she should know. How strong are these guys? Oh, fine. All right. Listen, buddies. Just because you're big doesn't mean you're allowed to not get staggered. Yeah, we need to go do the Robo Dojo as well. This has been a huge chunk of side quests, but really interesting content nonetheless, so I'm certainly glad to do them. Alright, let's mosey on back. I wonder... hmm... I think we'll hold off on going back to the resistance camp for the moment, because there, there might be like stuff we do in Pascal's village that brings us back there as well. So. Not dealing with you yet, jackass. No, thank you. All right. Let's transport to Pascal's village. Woohoo! All right, it's been a minute since we were back here, which means we should hit up the shop. Indeed, indeed. Okay, I don't remember auto stuff. Ooh. Yep, thank you, coming in. Now, ooh, if we buy two, can we put them together? I won't put all my money into that just yet, but that's awesome. That was some earthquake. Are you all right? I guess we haven't been here since the ground caved in in the city, huh? I've been told that providing is preventing. So, buy whatever you like. Uh, well, okay, so we have the machine sword and the machine spear that we do need to get. But unfortunately, we can't. All right. Uh, I don't think I really have anything I can sell at the moment either. Like, I think I've sold everything that, that I could sell. I hope that guy in the forest is okay. What guy? Also, let's see here. Yes, these folk. Hello! Well, that's it! Now my companion can fix what's been ailing him. I'm so glad we trusted you. Well, we'll leave this place as soon as we can. Please pray for our safe passage. Hey, there's some money. That's what we're talking about. Pearls, medium recovery, money, XP. Beautiful. Alright, uh, we've got the sister machines. Just looking to see if there's anything else here that needs doing, but...
I think talking to Pascal, that's going to advance the main story, right? I think so. Uh, well, we certainly don't want to do that. As soon as the maintenance is done. Well, we have to talk to Jean-Paul. And then see if there's other quests in this area that we can pick up. Alright, Jean-Paul. What asshole -ish things are you going to say today? Hello, Jean-Paul. Do you have a moment? Moments are transitory. One cannot possess them. A moment past is a moment lost. A symbol of idle, unrestrained apathy that... Can you please just take this present already? A gift? Let me see. Here you go. Ah, yes. Fascinating. The machine who gave this to us said you were both suspicious and alluring. It seems this so-called gift is nothing more than a piece of unadorned glass. Therefore, I can only surmise that... Uh, do you want to... Do you want us to bring a message back to the woman who gave this to you? For a mere trifle? No. Okay. Let's go. John Paul doesn't seem to appreciate these presents he's getting. I suppose we should go tell his followers exactly what he thinks of them, huh? Uh, they'll be waiting for some kind of reply. Aha! Uh -huh. Alright, I see. So now we're going to have to go back to all of them, which is slightly irritating, but whatever. Uh, more importantly, I would like to buy a sword, please. No, not the tool shop. There we go. Oh my god, we're just short. Okay, what can we sell? Um, Boltproof salves. There we go. Machine sword. Let's go. Uh, we're not going to equip it yet, though, just because it's not upgraded at all. What I do want to see, though, is its weapon story. The more old records I read, the more fascinated I become by the species known as humans. Oh, I guess this is machine voice. We machines must do all we can to preserve their precious artifacts and continue to record their contents. Interesting. Okay, cool. So, this must be from the perspective of one of like the peaceful machines, either in Pascal's village or elsewhere, which I guess makes sense, seeing as how we bought it from someone in the village. Cool. I love the different perspectives we're getting on the different machines. Come on, move the cursor. I just... Yeah, current destination. Okay. Figured. So, we've got photographs over here. We've got a little quest right here and a quest over here, which leads to... Back to Jean-Paul's memories. Interesting. Okay. So... Actually, wait, 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 wait. Let's put a marker down so it'll be easier for me to keep track of on the map. Can we put two? No. All right. This one. So, actually, okay, yeah, just straight out this way, it looks like. Oh, are we finally... Are we going to be able to get into the castle now? Oh, wait, no. What was all that about? Huh. No idea. Well, I'm sure we're going to find out. Yep, mother and son figured. Excuse me, can I ask what just happened? Oh, this is so embarrassing. But if you must know, I was arguing with my child. You don't say. That boy just refuses to listen to me, and now he's gone and run off to who knows where. This is terribly forward of me, but would you mind finding him and bringing him home? I'd go myself, but I'd never survive out there on my own. Sure, whatever. We'll see what we can do. <laughs> Look at you, big softy.
Oh, he, okay, he went out into the, oh, he went out into the actual city. Okay. Where the hell did he go? Actually, though, where did he go? Wandering couple, mysterious letter, resistance disappearance. Photographs. Wait. Okay, yeah, that's in. Uh, okay, that's in the the flooded city. Parade escort. John Paul's melancholy. Where the hell did this kid go? He's just gone. Huh. All right. Fair enough. Yeah, I got nothing. Okay, well, uh... I guess we'll just pop our head out here real quick. And just see... So this machine mother has a child, eh? It's surprising to see them form familial units like that. I wonder if they'll let us examine their brain circuits if we bring the kid home. Your scientific curiosity oh. is getting out of hand, 9S. Joking, I'm joking. Mostly. <laughs> so I guess he's over here. Got it, okay. Oh, there's a big one. Do you have the child, sir? Are you friendly, sir? Ow, you're not friendly. Oh, nope, nope, nothing friendly here. Sorry. Oh, you know what would probably be great here? Missiles. Oh, that aggro's like everything in a wide area, huh? I mean, kind of useful, though. Like, we can just sit back and just missile spam for days. That's kind of cool. Whoa, boy. That's aggro, though. Beautiful. Ah, for the machine examination. Cool, 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 cool. Beautiful, all right. So that's what that was for. Well then, geez, I have no idea where the kid would have gone. Maybe into the, like, shopping mall or whatever this is over here? Possibly? Also, why... Wait, can we go down here? Yo, check this out. I had no idea we could go down here. Oh boy, that was almost bad. I wonder if we die if we fall down there. Look at this! Iron ore. Yo, like, actually, we can just go all the way down here. No shit. Oh. Oh, I went from excitedly curious to disquieted extremely quickly. Oh, God. What were you guys? Okay, 28. That's not terrible. Oh, it's dark, though. I don't like that. Uh, why are we down here, though? And can we leave? I'd rather not mess with that just yet, I don't think. Crystal.
Is there anywhere else we can go, or is it just, like, down? Okay, I guess it's just down. That's interesting. Although, it also looks like... Oh, no, that's the path back into the village. Okay, got it, got it, got it, got it. Interesting. Well, we're gonna have to remember that. Huh! Alright, well, that just tells me I need to pay way more attention to potential little, like, avenues and alleyways and stuff that we can take. Not anything down there, is there? Nah, it doesn't look like it. Okay. Alright, child. I'm running out of time to try and find you in this episode. If you're not over here, you're gonna have to wait for next time. It's weird that he's not on the map at all. Really? No, okay. Unless he's now shown up, maybe. No, it still doesn't look like it. It's the Trial of Sand. Yeah, I don't know. I... yeah. I truly have no idea. So, if he's not in here... I mean, if I was a rambunctious kid running off from machine or otherwise, this would probably be where I'd go. Yeah, I've, I've got nothing on this kid. Huh. Machine chest. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Okay. What is... Wait. That sounded distinctly like a... Is that just our running noise? Okay. I... For some reason, I did not register... That that was our running noise. At all. I seriously thought there was like a weird hidden door opening or something. <laughs> Alright. Well. I think for now, that is going to be all the time that we have for this one. Um, I'll definitely have to spend some more time looking for that kid. I'm not sure where he would be at at this point, but we still have a bunch of side quests to do. Uh, we'll be blasting through as many of them as possible as quickly as we can. Maybe we'll spend some time advancing the story soon, but I'm worried about getting to the point where we're suddenly going to lose out on these side quests, and I don't want to do that, because they're fun. So, uh, we'll figure it out, though. Uh, that will be something that we save for next time. So, uh, thank you all so much for watching. I do very much appreciate it. If you know someone that you think would enjoy this series or any of my other series, if you could shoot them a link, I very much appreciate that. Until the next time, though, I hope you all have a good night. I thought a boar was about to attack me. <laughs> have a good night. Stay safe and healthy out there. And remember, be good to each other. Bye now.